using the Dash Mini Waffle Maker. So I just wanted to show you this today. I picked this up from Amazon.com for under $10. I believe they're running around $10 to $11, depending on what color you pick. So let's go ahead and get started. I used some canola oil on the inside, and I put that on there already. And I'm going to go ahead and drop some of the batter here. It's kind of thick. This is my third one making for today. I already ate two of them. So you just go ahead and put the batter in, and then you close the lid. Some batter on my fingers, but the light will come on after the light goes off. It lets you know that the waffle is ready. So I'm gonna go ahead and pause, and I'll come right back. You'll see some steam arising from this part right here. So it's still it's still cooking. I haven't tried anything else in this yet, like sandwiches. I'm pretty sure people have become real creative making certain things, but I haven't done anything outside of that. Okay, the light just went out. So that's letting me know that it's ready for the waffle to come out. So I just go ahead and open back up the lid. And you can see there's a waffle in there. And if you don't like the consistency of it, I would, you know, put the lid back down and let it go a little longer. But for the sake of time, I'm just going to take it out. I, I usually just use my hand. You can use a, a spatula if you like. Just make sure it's like a silicone spatula. And I just take it out like that. So... You can see how it looks. I don't think the lighting is doing this any justice. It's a little darker than what the light probably shows. But there you have it. That's how it comes out. And just top it off with a little bit of syrup. Just put a little syrup on here. I'm not going to eat this because I just ate two of them and I don't want any more waffles.